Hi everyone. We're looking deeper into the situation that's going on over into the Ukraine. As all of the world has been watching Russia as its forces gather and they have moved into Crimea and pushed on the borders of the Ukraine and have even enabled votes that part of the country has now stepped away and has wants to become part of Russia. In a short amount of time they have actually seized a whole part of another nation. Well, Russia has talked of, Putin has talked of that he wants like a competition for the Euro European Union or the NATO forces even, his own block of countries. Well, the one thing that's not being noticed that we're trying to look at now is that how Turkey is being set right in the middle and it's being left out here in the open now, stuck in between all of these things going on. This little area of purple strip is the Turkey area, and they have intercontinental ballistic nuclear missiles. It's not a small deal of this country. Let's go to here. But this is Turkey right here. And with all of the events that have been going on in Syria, remember Russia is allied with Syria right here. This is the only thing in between Russia and being right up against the border of Israel and going after Israel exactly as the Bible talks of in the Ezekiel 38 war that they come after Israel, that Russia rises up during the end of the age. They are one of the beasts of Revelation 13. They could be the beast that rises out of the sea and they're right by the Black Sea now. But I wanted to point this out, that here we have this situation, all matching Bible Scripture. The one thing to know about Bible Scripture is that mm, you could probably say that nearly all Christians and all Bible scholars have made the Bible so that it kind of protects them from any World War III. Everybody's theories does not believe that war can start suddenly. Everybody blocks the Bible, even Christians, even most churches, they say that nothing can happen suddenly. They have made up a giant list of things that they think must happen before any World War III may happen. As Russia is walking right up here, this is why Christians are not noticing it. They don't want this to happen. They have built every kind of lie they can you know, to believe that nothing can happen suddenly, that World War III cannot take over the whole world. And if it does, it won't affect you and your household. This is going to affect the whole world. And you should stick right with Scripture. This happens suddenly. They're ready to come after Israel, right here. And they will go after the USA too. It says in the Bible that ten nations will betray the USA, the daughter of Babylon. So we have Russia right here on the back door of Turkey, ready to step across at any moment as they're massing their troops up here. And Turkey the only NATO nation over here, well right here, is the only thing standing in the way of them and Israel, right across the Black Sea, just as it talks of in the Bible with the beast rising from the sea. Well, I just wanted to point that out, that this nation right here is stuck out here, left alone. Something's going on. And for those that are wondering why the USA is just kind of sitting back, they want this to happen. They want World War III. That is the only way to get to the next stage. It's all part of the Bible. Even here in the Denver International Airport where they have all of these giant murals, it shows the USA, Britain, and France going up against the red side. Russia, China, North Korea. It's all planned. People just deny that this can happen. As we have shown before, it, people have taken the Bible and they've built a wall with it to try to block Jesus Christ in the end times, saying in every way possible that there's no rapture, there's no real World War III, you know, that none of this can happen. All those thousands and thousands and thousands of nuclear weapons and big military ships and tanks and guns, they're not made for anything. It's made for World War III, and it's all being prepared, and they're walking right up and ready to create this giant thing that will happen all across the earth. So right here, right here I just wanted to show that we have the beast ready to rise out of the sea. They're amassing troops over here and here is Turkey left alone. 
the only thing in between them and Israel. And Syria is a tinderbox under war. The Ukraine is all in uproar and in unrest and has been invaded. And part of their country has been stolen. <laughs> it's happening and people will just continue to deny this until the bombs are flying. It's just part of human nature, I guess. Confess with your mouth, the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart, God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved.